Hey Tech Talk viewers, this is the Orbi Wi-Fi 7 add-on satellite. So this is the Black Edition 970 satellite. So um, the main reason for making this video is to answer that question. Can your old Orbi Wi-Fi 6 system work as satellites to the 970 system? And the quick answer is no. Unfortunately, these will not, the old Wi-Fi 6 will not be recognized. Uh, by your base router of the 970 series as of yet. I know Orbi and Netgear in the past have allowed prior generations of Wi-Fi 6 routers to have older um, satellites link up with the system. As of now, as of yet right now, the um, router will not allow for that. Uh, whether or not that be is added in in the future is possible. Um, although the backhaul would be at a slower speed and I don't know if the mesh network would be able to work on a mixed uh, backhaul kind of wireless strategy, although technically it could be possible. Uh, but I think right now um, Netgear has sandboxed the Wi-Fi 7 ecosystem within its own uh, system. So right now we do not have another um, router or satellite that is compatible with the 970 series. So as such, you do need to purchase the add-on satellites. I have three of the, you know, the original package here comes with two satellites, uh, but I had three satellites in my home setup. And um, these are for media centers uh, with a wireless backhaul. So I opted to get a third satellite. Now these satellites do run a pretty penny. Uh, these are about $800 each, right? So um, add that to your base system. Yeah, this system is rather expensive. Uh, the black decor is kind of nice. It, uh, it blends in better. You can actually notice that the last Orbi, uh, because of UV, um, I think UV damage, uh, actually starts getting a little yellow uh, on one of my routers here. That was in the sun. So you can see it's a little yellow compared to the white there. So again, uh, you may wanna consider the decor of your house in the choice. Uh, these new Wi-Fi 7s do come in um, white plates. So there is a white finish, although Orbi's um, black finishes do uh, complement kind of our, our decor a little bit better. And I'll actually show you this guy as we set it up as a satellite um, in one of our media centers here. No frills, basically this expensive satellite comes with the satellite unit and an AC adapter. That's about it. And some instruction cards uh, on how to link this up through the Orbi app, which is pretty easy. You just add satellite and wait for it to pair up and detect. So let's go ahead and do that. I'll show you how it hooks up um, and how it looks in our projector area, which is where I'm adding this in through some wired ethernet. Okay, well here is the Orbi Wi-Fi 7 now, uh, satellite kind of tucked in this area where we have our short throw projector, our screen, and this was our prior Orbi. I used to actually sit back down there, but because this thing uh, is so tall, I don't think I can just hide it out of view, so it's going to kind of sit on the shelving here. Fortunately, the screen kind of goes up the wall, so um, this shouldn't be occluded. But um, that's how kind of it sits, and we run our Ethernet straight to this now, um, as this used to have four ports. Again, the one downside is that this one only has three ports, so the satellite has two 2.5 gigabit um, adapter spots and then one 10 gigabyte 10 gigabit uh, Ethernet port. So we're down one port, but fortunately for the devices connected here, only have two hardwired ones. So uh, that should help with our high res streaming um, through the wireless backhaul. So that's how it kind of it sits um, in our decor here. Hopefully that gives you an idea of how the Orbi Wi-Fi 7 compares to the Wi-Fi 6 and how the satellite uh, is available for purchase separately, albeit at a pretty hefty price. So check out our uh, benchmark and our other unboxing of the main kit. Leave your questions below. We'll see you next time on Tech Talk on the Chan Plan. Thanks for watching.